everybody. Uh, if you don't know me, which you probably don't, my name is Antoine and I do vlogs when I travel. And it happened that I'm going back home to Bulgaria from where I'm from for Easter because this weekend is Easter there. So I'm going home to celebrate it with my parents. Uh, so it's going to be a nice week. I have nice things planned. Uh, I'm working, but I'm remote, and I'm currently at the airport. Yeah, then if you want to see some parts from Bulgaria, stay tuned. tomorrow but we picked up my grandma we are finally in Plovdiv because I landed in Sofia uh, and my parents chose the most Bulgarian restaurant ever and here is the toilet <laughs> ooh, ooh, okay ooh, the Bulgarian reality we already met some friends here is my grandma she's 75 years old here is a Bulgarian menu. Yogurt Daddy. I'm telling you, my mom is crazy. Good morning. Here are my parents. We came for a walk or a run, who knows? My mom is crazy. She's crazy about working out and being thin. So we came to the rowing canal. canal. And uh, I'll show you now. It's a very famous place in Plovdiv. <laughs> it's really nice weather today though, we're very lucky. And everybody here comes to um, work out and people are rowing already and they're also doing very important like um, competitions here. It's a, it's a famous canal. tiny village because we need to pick up some things from the superstore i'm still doing my nails so my parents went alone and here is the store we made it here is the villa i didn't want to see me 
О, много хубаво. Oh, it's so nice. Little heart house tour. Here it is. That's a bedroom. I'm not gonna show it. Here is the bathroom. And now we're going outside, everyone, because we're starting with the barbecue, and it's also very nice weather and fresh air. Okay, first hand is ready, one to go. Uh, I think the party moved outside, so I'm dressing up because it's cold. Uh, and we are gonna cook outside. Uh, my father is already drunk, as you can tell, dancing with the friend of my mother. And we are taking the dog outside now and moving everything outside. And it's gonna be very pretty when it's dark and we are putting now lights. <laughs> For some reason, I feel sick. Every time I come home, and then I get sick. I don't know how it happens, but it happens. So I took a paracetamol, and now I'm inside. And everybody's preparing food. I'm kind of lazy, so I'm like, sorry, I'll lay down. But here, the barbecue is almost done. Here is the barbecue, and my mother is preparing something in the kitchen as well. And I'm just eating cookies. This is amazing. Mm -hmm. Ти не се Good morning. <laughs> Everybody's tired of me filming. Here is my dad. Uh, they got so drunk yesterday, they couldn't move. And now they are eating leftovers from dinner, you guys. But it is so nice. And I am sick. Yeah, I am sick. Uh, I woke up. And it's time to go for breakfast and we are going to prepare a huge lunch so um the tradition here and what we're doing is that yesterday evening um on on saturday uh you have to go to the, to the church at 12 you're walking around it you're taking a candle and you have to light it up and you go home and if it, it when you go home if it's still light up then it means that you're a good person. If it's not, it means you did something wrong last year. Um, and yeah, and today we're doing a huge lunch. You already saw uh, that we are doing the fight with the eggs. We are preparing um, the the baby of a sheep, the baby sheep. This is what we are preparing. 
uh, a dish from and yeah pretty much that's it the eggs were already colored and the cookies were already made because this is done on thursday uh but my mom prepared it before i came so for me only the only thing that left is to actually eat it We are back home. We didn't do anything yesterday. I was only packing. But this is the best breakfast. Leftover cookies with coffee. And now I got ready because I'm going for a very quick coffee to have coffee for what, one hour with two guys that I know since I'm like five years old and we've been together from first to seventh grade and we're still friends. So we're going in the neighborhood to a coffee place. <laughs> It was a lot of fun, but a very quick coffee session and I am back home so that I can finish work. And from now on, nothing fun is basically gonna happen. Uh, I am working and after work, I have some appointments or meeting friends or packing. So nothing really interesting, but if I am out and I can do videos of my hometown, uh, I will make sure I have some so that I can put it here. Here is the beautiful part of the day. And also my favorite place ever. I don't have time to actually go to the old town and to the nice places in, in Plovdiv. I've only shown a little bit ugly places, but um, I'm working and I only managed to book a few appointments before my work and after work I have to go to the gym and I need to pack. So I have zero time and I have only four days in Plovdiv and I'm leaving to Tel Aviv. So will show you as much as I can but isn't this the most beautiful dentist um, office how is it called you've ever seen it's very cute and they know me so uh, they're always treating me super nice so cute Another day, another early appointment. Okay, I went to get a facial. Uh, so I'm kinda, kind of almost done with all the appointments. Now I have to go to the bank and in the afternoon I have to go to the hairdresser. But now I'm in the city center again. I have to be very quick because I start working 30 minutes. So. I'm kind of running, but I'm also going to show you the city center. We are back to my favorite uh, neighborhood, Kapan. <laughs> so nice and so, such a nice weather.
So the meeting is over, the presentation I mean. I was super worried. Um, but yeah, before that, I met with my grandma quickly at home. Um, then I jumped into the presentation and the meeting was three hours long. Um, so now uh, they had some feedback, so I'm changing it and updating it. So basically, this is everything that left to be done. Uh, and in 30 minutes, I'm going to my hairdresser. So I think I'm going to end this vlog here and it was not very interesting, uh, but I might put some um, videos of uh, of where I'm going to get my hair done because it's in a village, but I'm very specific with my hairdresser and even though she works in a village and it's 40 minutes drive, I am going there and that will be it. I hope you liked it. The next vlog will be from Tel Aviv because tonight I am leaving with my grand uh, with my mother to Israel for just one night. <laughs> so it's going to be fun. It's only 48 hours in Tel, Tel, Tel Aviv. Um, so let's see how this will go. But I hope you enjoyed at least a little bit. So I'll see you in the next video.